Good morning. It's supposed to warm up today. It's supposed to be a high of like 45. It's not 45 degrees right now. My eyes have been watering and just streaming down my face all morning. I have a little bit of a tailwind right now, which is super nice. Unfortunately, that means I'll have a headwind on my way back to the car. Hoping to do 100 miles today. The route that I have planned is 85 miles, and I thought I would do an out and back on my favorite roads, which this is one of them, to hopefully pick up the extra 15 miles to make it 100 even. That's the plan anyways. I'm kind of panic training right now. I have my first 200K in two weeks, and today is kind of the only day I think I'm gonna be able to try to get 100 miles in. It's supposed to winter again tomorrow and the next day. My route today is most of my favorite roads in Lake Country. The Wales, Delafield, Oconomowoc. I'm gonna head up to Hartford, Holy Hill area. Hopefully I won't have to ride up to Holy Hill. Last time I had to go up there to pee. Great here. Really hoping to not have to right up to Holy Hill today just to go pee. But who knows, it might happen. This morning, in a, I purposely parked in a parking lot next to a big gas station so that I could pee before I got started. But I was so cold that I panicked, didn't pee, just got on my bike and started riding because I was really cold. And I forgot all about going pee. Rookie mistake. Sun's out. No guns out today. <laughs> Here's a seminary. I have two food stops planned. One in Oconomowoc at Ginger Ovens, of course. Get a coffee and a cinnamon roll. My other food stop is planned for Hartford. There's a cafe that I ride right past in downtown Hartford that I've stopped at before. I had a bowl of soup there once that was good. So maybe I'll have some soup when I go there. I'm trying not to stop for too long on my stops because we have friends coming over tonight from out of town to visit. So I'm trying to be home by about six o'clock. Got a bit of a later start than I wanted to this morning because I was super tired. I don't know. I'm actually kind of glad I didn't start any earlier because it's freaking cold. So if I would have started two hours earlier, it would have been like barely 20 degrees. I would have needed ski goggles. All done at Ginger Ovens. Had a cup of coffee, cinnamon roll. I've drank two sips of water so far. Oh God, so far on this ride. Um, probably not good, eh? Cold, oh, fuck. I stopped off at the Wizard of Oz statue and mural. That's like basically right next door to the Ginger Ovens. I, did, I never noticed it until the last time I was out there riding and I was like, whoa, what's that? I didn't stop though, but this time I did. Took a picture on my bike with the little statues. Oh, it's okay, Bob. It's okay, stay. Stay, good dog. Oh God. Um, so I stopped took a picture of my bike with the statues and then these two little old ladies came walking by and they're like hey want us to take your picture I was like yeah sure thanks and then I took their picture and they asked me why I was out here riding my bike and I said well I rode my bike out here to get 
in the ocean. Wrong turn. Whoops. Um, I rode my bike out here to get a cinnamon roll at the ginger ovens. So I referred them to the ginger ovens and they're like, ooh, a cinnamon roll, that sounds good. I'm like, oh yeah. And then as I was riding past the ginger ovens on my way out of town, the ladies were just walking through the door there. So I'm really happy that they went. They say, shit, I'm lost. Um, I missed my turn somehow. I should probably pay attention to my Garmin instead of talking nonsense at the camera. I swear to God, this is the road though. No? No. Oh wait, this was the right road. I just didn't go further down it. Duh. I saw these two cute little ladies. Glad they went to ginger ovens. But yeah, they never. there's never anybody in there when I go. I don't know why. Coffee's decent, cinnamon rolls are amazing. And they have other things too, like smitches and like bagel sammies. And I think other like breakfast items and lunch items. They do frou-frou coffee drinks. You know, they do PSLs in the fall. I just have coffee or a latte because I'm basic. Ooh, look at these sandhill cranes. Hello. Pterodactyls, hello. They were just honking. Oh, there they go. <laughs> so loud. I saw some sandhill cranes earlier too. I didn't realize they hung out in the winter time here. Maybe they forgot to leave and migrate. Whoops. Oh, there's some more. Holy shit. Look at this guy. Big ass pterodactyl. What the heck? Hello. Damn. I'm like a nature safari today. Yeah, I thought sandhill cranes migrated. Apparently they forgot to. Okay. Slow going today. It's windier than uh, anticipated. I feel like I can call myself a real cyclist now because all I do is whine about the wind. Me! It's so windy. Me! I thought I was going to have a tailwind for the first half of my ride. No. It's been a headwind most of the way. Where's my trail? Oh, here it is. Okay, stand by. Besides being a little bit on the cold side and it being really windy, it's been a great ride so far. Roads are dry, which is great. So, on to Hartford. There are two gas stations that I can stop at for a potty break if I need it. Probably won't because I haven't drank any water. But I did have two cups of coffee, so I'm sure I'm gonna have like an emergency coffee pee in like 10 minutes. I guess I'm just gonna have to hold it. Oh God, if I have to ride up to Holy Hill to pee again, I'm gonna be so mad at myself. Such a dumb dumb. There's another crane. What the heck, are they maybe arriving from migrating? Joke's on them, winter's still here. Survived the Hartford Hill area. Man. Crosswind pretty much blowing me all over the road. I stopped at a gas station in Hartford just before getting to Pike Lake where like the real hills in that area start. It was quite an experience. They had a chicken wing special today. It's Wednesday apparently and it was a uh, wing Wednesday. So they had wings for sale. They had like a whole area with hot food, fried chicken and whatnot. A big liquor department, wide bait, and like a milkshake machine thing. I mean, what a time to be alive. And the gas station has 
all of that stuff. Okay, so I have an update on the sandhill cranes. It turns out, you know, they know what they're doing. I didn't realize it's the middle of March. You know, I'm, on, I'm never oriented to time. And I've seen a ton of them today in pairs. So I'm thinking they didn't forget to migrate south for the winter. I think they're arriving for the season. I've seen a ton of them today. And there were some over here before when I came through. Oh, you can hear them. Oh, there they are. Well, you won't be able to see that far away with the wide angle camera lens, but I realize they obviously know what they're doing and I don't. And for people who don't believe that dinosaurs ever existed, please watch a sandhill crane fly and please also listen to the call that they make. If that isn't a window into what pterodactyls sounded like, I don't know what is. And now I gotta like climb up all these other hills. <sighs> I didn't really think this through. Anyways, I'm gonna put the camera away because I'm about to go down a really steep hill and I'm gonna try not to die. Um, because, well, besides that lady right there that's walking down this street very far away from me, if I crash and die, no one's gonna find me. So, goal is to not die. Okay, bye. Well, <clears throat> back at the car. Made it. Not 100 miles, though. My legs totally died this last hour or so. So, I don't know, I did like 88 miles or something like that. Uh, I barely made it. I usually am joking when I say that, but I made it today. Holy cats. My, my quads are just dead. Whew. Oof. Today was tough. Tough, tough, tough. Bit of a reality check for the 125 mile ride that's coming up in two weeks. Right row. Thanks for coming along on my ride. Thanks for watching the videos. Remember to like and subscribe and leave a comment. I always forget that one. Pro tip, wear ski goggles when it's cold outside. My poor laser eyes just watered and streamed down my face literally the entire day today. My eyes are killing me. I had LASIK back in January. And man, oh man, my eyes are just constantly watering. Um, I put drops in a few times today to try to stay ahead of some of the dryness that's sure to come as soon as I get home. Pack up the bike, I gotta pee real bad. Again, strategically parked right next to a gas station. Probably can't see it. Uh, that's a quick trip right there. It's a real nice one. I don't know if they have wings on Wednesdays, like that other gas station I stopped at, but they for sure have a bathroom and I need to get gas. Um, and I might get something warm to drink too because I'm cold. I've been cold all day today. Um, again, I blame it on the wind, but here we are. So, thanks for coming along for my ride. See you next time. Goodbye. Okay, just a quick update. This quick trip does have wings. They also have hot sandwiches and fresh pizza, okay? Again, what a time to be alive. Who knew you could get this kind of stuff at a gas station? I sure didn't. I was very tempted to get a piece of pizza, but if I didn't have friends who were driving over an hour to come to my house to make me dinner, I would have gotten a piece, but I did not. See my appetite for whatever Josh and T are making us for dinner. So I just thought I would give you an update. I also made the mistake of looking in the mirror when I was in the bathroom. That my eyes look awful, they're bloodshot, and I look like I'm high. But I assure you, I'm only high on life, okay? Good. Tell your mom!